What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Fire Red walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we went through the cycling road all the way to Seafoam Islands, and now this episode is going to be all about the Seafoam Islands. And yes, I did, I did indeed heal up my Pokemon. So let's go right ahead and uh, let's take care of this business right here. So here is the Seafoam Islands, home to a lot of water type Pokemon. A lot of rare water type Pokemon too. Slowbro or Slowpoke, Slowbro. Believe Crabby, you can actually find it. And uh, yeah, you also need a Pokemon that knows strength right here because uh, yeah, you need to push around some of these things. There's just one little issue, and that is I forgot to I forgot to teach somebody strength. Luckily, I do have a Pokemon that knows how to learn strength, and that is Kit Thunder right here. So let's go right ahead and teach Kid Thunder some strength. Okay, so let's see. Oh yeah. You know what? We're gonna take away Swift because, well, we don't really need it much. And there we go. We had taught, or we are teaching Kid Thunder strength. Look at that. Okay. So, the only two things that you need right here, guys, is a Pokemon that knows strength and Surf. That will get you around here. And if you're entering the Seafoam Islands through this area, you need to uh, you need to push these boulders in order to in order to move around here and make sure that the flow or the tide goes down. You will obviously find some ice heels, some rare items right here. That way you guys can uh, maneuver your way around here. And well, let's see. Let's go right here and push this down. And if we go right here, you will be able to find the boulder that has been uh, pushed down right here. And chances are it's going to be going through the final floor in this whole area. My suggestion is don't go down that hole until you get both both rocks moving around right here. So let's go right ahead and go all the way down right here. And let's see. This is probably the second floor right here. Again, you'll find items like Revive and all that crud. Maybe an Ultra Ball. And there is the other boulder that you actually pushed around. So let's go ahead and push this. And here we go. Pushing that around. And I believe there is another entrance right here that you guys can actually be interested in. Now make sure to actually have some uh, max repels right here, guys. Because there will be some Pokemon that you're going to be taking on. And yes, off screen I am going to be capturing some of these Pokemon. Now let's go ahead and take this uh, ladder right here. And this one right here is the exit. So, I, yeah, I was mistaken. If you go right here towards the back side, you will be able to find another item right here and plus another boulder and let's go ahead and use this strength and kid thunder pushing this guy around bam now the other boulder is going to be on the other side and i believe that like these two boulders this this floor right here is the last floor that you need to push these boulders in so let's go right ahead and find the other boulder i think let's see the easiest route would have to go down to go down there and you actually have to go right here so first is first let's get let's go ahead and grab items we got a big pearl and let's see max repel and find that final boulder because that final boulder is needed to actually slow the tide now if you go right here guys you will be able to find the boulders that will lead into articuno's room we're not trying to go there just yet as you guys can see this is Articuno's room, and if you guys can tell, the river or the lake or the riverbank right here is like is mess. It's mess around. It's just you can't surf in it except for this whole area right here. And the whole objective, hold on just a sec, is to put the extra boulder right there. That way the tide actually slows down. So let's go back up, and I think we could surf right here. All right, so we're surfing. And we can't go right here just yet, but there is an item right there which we will be getting before we capture Articuno. So let's see, let's go right here and push this little sucker right here. Okay. And there we go. Splashes into the bottom floor. And, well, let's see. As you guys can see, this slows uh, this slows down the tide, and this will actually. I think it will uh, allow you to go into another room from here. Could be wrong. Yeah, I was wrong. Okay, so 
That is that. Now we have to actually grab the item and go towards Articuna, which I really don't want to do. So here we go. We found ourselves in Ultra Ball. And go up here. And, well, let's see. Another repel's being used. Let's go right ahead. And, let's see, what do we got? Oh yeah, you can actually go through this whole area right here, too. So let's go right ahead and check this whole place out. I really don't want to... Yeah, I really don't want to mess this up right here, guys. Because I believe... Yeah, this actually dries up the waterfall and... Well, yeah, this is... Yeah, it dries up the waterfall right there. So let's go right ahead and see what's up here. Let's see what's up here. And yes, this is actually the exit towards uh, the other side right here, guys. And there it is. Exit. So we're not doing that just yet. We actually need to go towards Articuno because, yeah, Articuno. Yeah, I'm, you, you guys can tell by the, the sound of my voice, I am dreading trying to capture this Pokemon. If you guys haven't caught my episode where I'm trying to capture, where I'm trying to capture what you will call it, Zapdos, yes. Yeah, very, very angry. So let's go right ahead and just push this. Okay, so let's go ahead and push that. And push that. We go down here. And, well, there we go. And one more thing. Bam. There you go. Now we're going to be going down to the... Down to this little uh, watery area right here. And what we're going to find is nothing but Articuno. Oh, God. Okay, so we're going to be saving this game because I really, really am dreading this whole thing. Okay. So, let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon. As many of you guys already know, Articuno is an Ice-type Pokemon. Ice and Flying, it is going to be a tough one. Let's go! Go you! Uh, God, I hate Articuno. This is like my fifth attempt trying to capture this god dang Pokemon, guys. It really is. And there you go, we finally captured him after how many attempts? Oh my god, my head hurts. Yeah. Holy crud. So, here we have Articuno, just like Zapdos, two annoying Pokemon that you, you, you need to capture. And believe it or not, guys, fifth time. Alright? Every single time. They wasted all my Pokeballs aside from the Master Ball. Annoying. Very annoying, okay? So here we have Articuno, the Freeze Pokemon. One of the legendary bird Pokemon, with with its long tail trailing behind, its flying form is magnificent. Yeah, well, it's not magnificent right here. Again, if you guys have seen my Pokemon Leaf Green walkthrough, you know you know exactly what I would nickname this Pokemon. But yeah, we're not gonna do that. We're gonna move on ahead. God dang Articuno! So there it is, guys. We caught ourselves Articuno, speeding through this whole thing. Oh my god! See, this is the reason why I don't like capturing uh, legendary Pokemon because. It's just, it's annoying. It really is, especially on emulator where you can actually dictate the whole, uh, dictate the way you, you freeze and you're, you, you, or you save or you load the states and all that crud. Yeah, it's, it's just annoying. Holy crud. Okay, so let's go ahead and use a Max Repel and let's move on ahead and let's get the heck out of here right here. All right, so yeah, we can't go through there. What was I smoking? I don't know. Go up here, and here we go, right here, and it, oh wow, okay, so let's just go through the hole right here, ha, <laughs> said hole, okay, so easy exit right here, and we're gonna go straight to this staircase right here, and right up here, and there we go, Seafoam Island's how about that? Okay, so we're finally outside. Oh my god. God, do I hate... God, do I hate Articuno. Okay, so let's just go ahead and start battling some trainers, because that's what you guys came here for. Getting to see me frustrated and getting to see Pokemon battles. And here we have Tentacool going up against uh, good old Zapdos. You know what? Screw it. Let's go right ahead and do it. Let's go right ahead and do it. Let's speed it up. Drill Peck for the win. OP all the way. 
Let's go, Sparky. Take out the frustration on all these Pokemon trainers. Yes. This is what happens when you're... This is what happens when you're annoyed by one... One legendary Pokemon. You just OP everybody. Alrighty. So let's get the heck out of here. Let's go right ahead and see if we... If our repel has lingered. Yeah, it's still lingering. Okay. So, here we are getting the heck out of the Seafoam Islands. And now we are in route. I do not know. Let's see. I may have missed it. I don't know. What route are we in? Yes, we are in Route 20. On our way to Celadon City or uh, Cerulean City. So let's go ahead and start battling everybody. I rode my Pokemon here. My bird Pokemon here. Mm hmm. Okay, so here we go. Taking on Roger. Let's go. Drill Peck. There we go. Coming out with a Fero. Thunderbolt. There we go. Keep it going. Pidgeotto. How about that? Okay. So, let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon right here. Let's get the whole shocker going. And let's go ahead and start battling everybody right here. As many of you guys already know, I like to speed through this whole thing right here. Let's go. My boyfriend gave me big pearls. <laughs> wow. Oh, my lord. Big pearls. Big innuendo right there. So let's go right ahead. Take on uh, a shelter right here. Shockwave for the win. Shockwave again. And let's go with another shockwave. Let's just do that. And there we go. That is how you do it. Okay. Let's see. Big pearls. Her boyfriend gave her big pearls. You can't get over that. <laughs> okay. So let's go right ahead and take on this guy right here. Check out my buff physique. I'm sorry, but... <laughs> That's just a swimmer's body, and swimmers are not really buff. They're just, you know, <laughs> they're just lean. And here we go. Taking on Kid Thunder. Let's go. There we go. We're not taking on Kid Thunder. We're taking on this guy. Their, phys their physique are lean, and if they, what was it? I believe if they weigh a little too much on muscle, then, yeah, they're not going to be good at swimming, like, fast. So just be aware of that. And, well, let's go ahead and switch out to Zapdos right here. And let's see what she has. I swam here from Cinnabar Island. It wasn't easy, I tell you. Really? Okay, so let's go right ahead and take on Picnicker Missy. Let's do this. Drill pack. Oh, look at that. Sea Queen. Or Sea King. I don't even know. Alrighty. There you go. Let's get the heck out of here. Let's get this. Alright. We are close towards the end right here, guys. Holy crud. Let's see. Uh, who hasn't gotten some, uh... Well, let's go with Shocker again. I really don't care. Again, guys. Articuno really messed me up. <laughs> it really messed me up, and I'm just like, dude, seriously. Why do you have to be this frustrating to capture? Seriously. I'm gonna put the link on the description for the Leaf Green walkthrough. I am. Okay, so here we go. Shockwave. And Shocker's finally grown to level 40. Let's go with Sparky. And there we go again. Level 36, and Melissa has been defeated. How about that? Okay, so here we are, finally. Cinnabar Island. How's it going? Whew, okay. After uh, after all those events, we have finally made it to Cinnabar Island. And, uh, well, in the next episode, guys, we will be going through everything on Cinnabar Island from the lab through the burnt uh, building and quite possibly the... Pokemon Gym, and, well, of course, the Pokemon Gym, you have the option of battling only one person, so, yeah. So, thank you guys again for watching, thank you guys for laughing at my misery, and staying patient as always. I will be back tomorrow for another episode of our Pokemon Fire Red Walkthrough. See you guys.